Howdy, y'all. It's Mr. Kazi coming to you from beautiful Atascacita, Texas, with another chemistry lesson. And today we're going to talk about writing chemical equations. And I'm going to give you an example that goes along with one of our others. You're going to need a periodic table. You'll need a polyatomic ion chart. And you might even need your solubility rules. All right. Let's take a look here. I'm going to make a few assumptions. You can write uh, chemical formulas. You know how to name chemicals. You understand the periodic table. And you know uh, polyatomic ions and what they are. If you have any trouble with any of these, check my YouTube channel, Mr. Kazi, uh, for videos on all of these different subjects. All right, the problem. Write and balance the chemical equation for the reaction between cobalt-2 uh, nitrate and potassium sulfate. Now, those are our reactants, so what we need to do is determine the products, write the equation, and then balance it. All right, so let's go to the blackboard. First, let's determine the products. Here's the uh, reactants, and now the reactants are going to break up into uh, cobalt-2 uh, ion and nitrate and potassium and sulfate and the cobalt and sulfate will balance real good with each other and the uh, potassium and nitrate will go together charges match up and we have a chemical equation but it's not balanced so let's take a look here there are two potassium on this side, one potassium on this side. So we need to have um, two potassium on the right side. But don't change the subscripts. You can only change the coefficient. And we'll put a two out in front there. And it's balanced. Everything else matches. So let's recap. You determined the products. You wrote the chemical equation. And you balanced the equation. Way to go. Thanks for watching this video. Give me a thumbs up and don't forget to check out some of my other videos and don't forget to subscribe. Happy Island, y'all.